Guys, welcome back. Woodbury um, cabin thing, part two. Um, so we were ab about to take a shower, and we did. Mike was trying to watch some TV, but the TV is still off, and he is nowhere to be found, which is very suspicious. Mike, where are you, buddy? Oh, what? Hey Harp, check this out. I found this fishing rod in that shed. Plan to catch dinner? Now that you've mentioned it, that would be a pretty epic addition to the trip. Uh, I don't know, it's kinda cold. Come on. Uh, what, make, what, one, what would make this trip more epic than catching our own freaking dinner? Okay, I guess that could be fun. Hell yeah, follow me. There is another road to the shed so we can both give it a shot. Bro, you just said you're gonna watch TV. Come on, Harp, it's this way. I guess I have no choice. The bro this guy is just forcing me to do everything. You're not gonna lock me in that shed, are you? Do you wanna grab the other fishing rod, Harp? Yeah, just give me a second. Okay. Where's the other fishing rod? Wait a second. Is this a trap? Is this a trap, bro? Where's the other fishing rod? Am I... Oh. Okay. I saw a killer recipe for baked carp. We need to catch, catch three carp though. Uh, you up for a challenge, okay? Well, first things first, we need to get bait for carp. Check out the bait information board. Whenever you are ready, grab the carp bait and let's head to the creek. We're going to catch some carp carp. <laughs> Let me grab the bait. Okay. What's up with the music? It's not... Why is it so chill? It should be unsettling. Need to attach some bait or lure. Wow, that's... Hope those carps are biting today. Yeah, that's pretty chill actually, not gonna lie. Um, put on the hook. Okay. How do I... Yeah, right mouse to put on hook. Oh, oh, oh. Uh... Oh crap, M to move the slide, good job, but if you keep using the bait, we'll be here all day without a single carp, time to switch up, okay. Okay, bait attached. Uh oh, wasted my bait again. Oh, come on. Yay! Uh, trout. Oh, wait, so we were supposed to get the carps, right? Not the trout. Um... I mean... He wanted carbs, I don't know, bro. Throw back, keep. He wanted carbs, so. Oh. 
fishy. You're a mine fishy. Come on, come on, come on. I'm not letting you go. Blue, blue gill. Oh God. It's a bit tedious when you have to do this with a creepy ass person, right? Yellow perk. Um. <sighs> Okie doke. That's a lot of fish. I feel like I'm playing a fishing simulator here. Oh god. Wait a second, I think I know what's wrong. I didn't get the right bait. Bro, the, the guy did say at the very beginning I need to check uh, the instructions, right? So, for specific fish I need to get specific food, bait, whatever, you know what I mean? Huh, that's interesting how it makes you... Bait and fish, uh, pairing knowledge. Okay, one carp. Uh, sweet corn, chances of catching. Goldfish, common... Oh, common carp! Yeah, that's it, that's it, bro. Okay, so, sweet corn. Cheese. I got the... That's cheese. Golden lure. Frozen prawns. Where's the sweet corn? Oh, no, bro. Wait, I got maggot bait. Oh, I got the wrong bait. There we go. What's this? No, no, no. I need to... What else can I use to ca catch a um, common carp? Cheese. Cheese. Okay. That works. Which is weird, but here goes nothing. We need three, which is like easy enough. Already caught like four fishes, right? So, well, it was just like something random, not what we actually needed. Okay, got the bait. Come here, you carp. Come here, I got you. Blue gill. Oh man. Still not what I need. Okay. Here, fishy, fishy. Still blue gill. Oh, come on. have some editing to do, really need to cut this part out. Not gonna be that exciting to see me fish. Bro, they say whenever there is one carp, there is always more. Oh, really? You don't say? How interesting, bro. Yoink. Ah, carp, please, carp. I got you. I got you, bro. Oh, no. Please. I mean, 
it's better to stay here than in the house, right? Watching TV. Yay! Come on, cop! Yes! Yes, bro, I'm winning! Woohoo, just one more left! Yay! Woohoo! Something tell me you're not excited about getting the carbs, right? You're just excited about watching the quote unquote TV? Just basically Netflix and chill, right? Uh that's a bummer. It is interesting how you can fish using cheese as bait. I had no idea that's a thing. Oh man. Yellow. I gotta say, th this is a little bit weird that they, and unusual in a good way, that they decide to add this element to a horror game. Because you're literally, you're literally fishing. It's interesting, not gonna lie. Please, car, please. I get the fish. Oh. Come on, man. Come on, carp. Come on, carp. Come on, carp. Yes. Oh, yes. All right. Uh, all right, carp. Looks like we got three carps. Uh, do you want to go back and throw these in the oven for dinner? Yeah, let's do it. Uh oh, ominous music is back. Chill music is over. Do I just get rid of my fishing rod? Just leave it here? Or do I use it as a weapon? Yeah, I'll just keep it just in case. Gonna hit him. Just to let you know, Mike. Quote unquote, Michael, I have a weapon here. While I'm cleaning the fish, do you mind prepping the marinade? Not sure how to do it. Just take a bowl and throw in ginger paste, cooking oil, black pepper, salt, Italian seasoning, paprika, and yogurt. Okay, bro. Okay, oh yeah, thank you. That's easy enough. Salt. No, that's not it. Salt. No. Where is the salt? It's definitely not in the fridge. Oh, there we go. Salt. Black pepper. Nope. Ooh, someone's outside, bro. Can hear a car. Uh, paprika. Italian seasoning. Ginger garlic paste. Olive oil. Uh, olive oil, olive oil. Where is the olive oil, bro? What's this? Okay, okay, put the milk back in, bro. Don't need that. Huh. That's weird. Where did they keep... Oh, okay. And yogurt. That's the thing he bought. Okay, boss. I got gotcha. you. 
Do you mind throwing the fish and the marinade in the casserole while I chop these veggies? Okay. Had to add fishes first to carbs. Oopsie. <laughs> okay. Where's the fish? Marinade. Hey, bro. Catch. <laughs> now, could you add the veggies? I read it needs to go for 30 minutes at 400. Okay, bro. Sure. Sure. Can you add the milk then? Huh? I can add stuff. You don't have to worry. You don't have to worry, my man. Uh, anyway. Um, veggies. Peppers. These are peppers. Um, oh yeah, there we go. Okay. It didn't let me choose the temperature though. Those carbs are going to taste amazing. Oh, you're so excited, bro, I can tell. While we wait for it to cook, how about we play some board games? I saw some in the room next to the living room. I guess we could. Uh, which one? Just grab whatever catches your eye. I can't wait to see what you pick. I saw some in the room next to the living room. Okay, let me see. Oh, God. Um, next to the living room, you said. Tower stack. What's this? Whispers in the dark. Unravel the secrets, immerse yourself in the mystery. Oh, this sounds interesting. Okay. Bruh. I'm ready. Why is the door open? Here you go, bro. How about something that gets our adrenaline pumping? Okay. Not feeling that one right now, Harp. You asshole. Get one yourself, then. <laughs> Why are you asking me? Adrenaline pumping. I thought it was the adrenaline. Mega rounds, tower stack. Oh, Ouija board. Yeah, that's the part that gets your heart pumping, right? Oh snap! Is that Ouija board? <laughs> Molly once told me how she con contacted her dead grandma through one of these boards. I can't stand her spiritual bullshit. Hey. Remember how the dude was acting weird about the basement? What if we try this down there? That's a great idea. Alright, let's go. It's not a great idea, bro. It is such a not great idea. Huh? What's that? What the... Wait, is that a guy? Bro, what? Oh, Jesus, it's just a shirt. Jesus, what the hell? Watch out for spiders! <laughs> and now what will make this even spookier? What now? Let's turn off all of these lights and see if this thing really works. Uh... No, how about no? Oh god. Oh man. Anyways, do you know how this works, Harper? No. <laughs> okay. So here's how it works, the guy is like... Here's how it works, yeah, thank you. First we'll place our fingers slightly on the planchette. We have to ask questions, and the spirits, if uh, there are any, uh, will move the planchette to spell out the answers. Or at, uh, or at least that's what Holly told me. Okay. One more thing, Harp. Never take your fingers off the planchette until we say goodbye, otherwise we might uh, tick off some spirits, she said. Okay, so you wanna touch my fingers, huh? Alright then, you go first. Okay, are there any spirits who want to talk to us? Do you want us to leave? Can you see us? <laughs> that
definitely not fake, bro. Ooh, so spooky. Whispers, no way, are you moving it? That wasn't me. Okay, I got one too. Go ahead. How's the afterlife treating your body? Hey, be respectful. Okay, I'm not reading any of that, so... Did you live in this house? What's your name? Are you friendly? Ah, uh, okay, I'll go with the house. My turn. Come on, buddy, give us a sign. Let us know you're here. Holy crap! What the hell, Mike? Wait for me! What the... I'm not usually one to believe in ghosts and spirits. But I'd be lying if I said I didn't feel uneasy that night. Yeah, okay, bro? There's some freaky shit going on down here, Harp. That was weird. The weird part is that you ditched me. You mean weird how you left me. I mean... What the hell, Harp? I figured out you would move your ass too. Would have been nice if you had checked. Yeah? Have you ever heard of uh, fight or flight? Sydney, I'm sorry, okay? Whatever. Definitely not gonna be an awkward dinner now. I think uh, our snow is about to come on. You want to watch TV while we eat? Sorry, show. Uh, let's do it. Oh, there's a TV in here. Oh, okay, that's good. I was thinking like, bro, you really have to go upstairs to the bedroom to watch TV? Not sitting with you, bro. I guess I don't have a choice. Uh, okay, I need to switch down the TV. Biggest chocolate cake with a spoonful of mayonnaise. This delicacy is very popular in Romania, where the show mayonnaise was on. flows down the rivers. Like <laughs> what is this show, bro? Water park. So first, we are going to prepare the asparagus. Season these with a lot of salt. Salt is what is happening? The bones. After letting these simmer in the salt bath, we can start making the chocolate. And take a couple okay. cocoa beans. Ah, uh, yes, the cocoa beans need the TV show to was be on. blended into the sauce with a little bit of vinegar. Okay, I guess I can go and explore stuff. Flavor in there. The next thing we prepare is the mayonnaise. See so ya, yeah, bro. Enjoy Stir the fish. Fry this in a pan with or can I uh, have a tofu. piece of that? I'm not gonna lie. This is gonna taste no. like shit. But here you are, anyway, listening to my cooking instructions. Okay, see so ya, yeah, bro. This is the brain of the mayonnaise. We, we gotta What's this? It with oh, it's the game. Anesthesia to make sure it Have fun, bro. Against us. Have fun, bro. Very angry Have fun, bro. Knows we're trying to cook it. After doing that, we mix all the ingredients together in a tray and place it inside the oven. Had to grab light. Oh, that's what I'm missing. I, I need, actually need to get the fish. I thought the guy had like the portion for the two of us. What the hell? I just wasted all of the time. Extremely hard to make. A dish only for experienced cooks. It requires a lot of patience and skill. Mm, yum, 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 yum. What yummy, yummy need fish. Is gasoline and ramen. This dish really soothes the soul. 
almost like a high-end cleanse. We begin by pouring the gasoline into the. What is the show, bro? Make sure not to use whole gasoline since it's really bad for you. Okay, please finish Maybe the fish already. I was done with. Okay, cool. Oh, half half. crap. That was some damn, damn fine food. Diesel. Twice as good since we caught the fish so ourselves. The it was alright. You don't have to rain on my parade, Harp. It was no most pizza, but I thought it turned out well. Hey, anyways, I need to check my emails real quick. Left my laptop upstairs. Thought we were taking a break from work. Um, I really don't want to trigger him. But if I don't respond, it's a bit weird. Uh, it's not work, I'm just watching on shipping details for my new DS. Uh, I'll be right back. Alright, I'll clean up here. Okay, I'll do the dishes until then. Okay. If you're oven, Seems like it's uh, easy fire. enough. Uh, make sure to I'm watching you, bro. Shall I follow him? Well, damn. Shall I follow him, bro? Damn, Had to do both of our plates. Oh man. But, but, but not to worry. I know someone who will. Yo, grandma. Yo, I made you food. Dishwashing, Don't mind me, I'm just washing my dishes. I have a feeling since I can't control the camera, I'm washing the dishes. Something weird's gonna happen now. By the time I'm done, or not? The TV is a bit distracting, so I'm gonna get rid of that. We can still Ooh, why is he sending me texts? I think there is someone under my bed right now. Can you come upstairs? What? What the fuck? Bro, I need my fishing rod. That is such a fucking weird thing to do. Don't make sounds, walk slow. Which, which is his bedroom, though? Hello? It's definitely him. And he's gonna be like, ha ha ha, it's just a prank, bro. <laughs> gotcha, you motherfucker. What the hell? You're lucky I didn't break your nose. <laughs> I totally got you. That was fun, wasn't it? That's not cool. Come on, it was just a joke. You wanna go for the next round? Next round? How about a game of hide and seek? I'll get back to you for this. No, I don't wanna... Whatever you say, Sydney Harper. Alright, you're on. I'll count to ten. What? Bro, I need to... Fucking... I decided to hide in the basement. Well... Okay, that's... At least I got the instructions. Oh, 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 the basement. Um... The basement was... Over there? And open the door. I decide to what? You decide to do what? I decide to hide in the nook under the stairs. Okay. Thank you. 
Okay. That wasn't even a challenge. I figured you would be good at this since I never find you in the city. Maybe you need to look harder? <laughs> okay. Alright, my turn to hide now. You'd better close your eyes and start counting. Mike, why is hiding? I don't want to close my eyes, to be honest, but... I guess I have to follow the rules. 1 Mississippi, 2 Mississippi, 3 Mississippi, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Ray or not, here I come. Definitely not creepy. Two adults in the middle of nowhere playing hide and seek in some branded house. What could go wrong after playing the Ouija board especially, right? It's definitely not in that closet. Gotcha. Hang on, Harp. I think I heard something upstairs. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice. You're going to try this again? No, no kidding, Sydney. I really heard something uh, sliding up there. You didn't hear that? No, I didn't. I swear on my life, I heard something. I see this attic access door in here. Oh no. You're not serious. What? What? Did he just try to lock me in that closet? Bro. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you, bro? I need a step stool. Where am I supposed to get that? Step stool. Oh, there we are. Why am I going in alone? What the hell? Definitely not creepy. Oh, bro, it's just a cat. Wait, kitty. Oh. Oh. So the guy wasn't lying about the cat then. Oh. Okay then. Kitty. Oh. Cats are awesome. Okay, I guess it's just a cat and we can go downstairs. Nothing suspicious. Right? Sydney, are you okay? What was up there? I, uh, I was just a cat. <laughs> it looks like you aren't the only pussy in the house. Nah, bro, don't aggravate him. <laughs> oh, that's a relief. It was I was worried there for a minute. Uh, I think she was hungry. You ready to count again? Oh yeah, maybe we can give her one of the carps after I come find you again. Okay, I don't have a choice. I decided to hide in the tool shed in the backyard. Oh, bro, you're just escalating stuff at this point. Uh oh, I don't like that. Don't like that one bit. Really? Bro, how stupid can you be? Like, this guy's already creepy, like... Red flags all over the place, and you're like, Oh, I'm gonna go outside and, and hide in this tool shed, you know? Oh, such a genius idea. <laughs> okay. I'm in the tool shed now. Where's the guy? Is he coming? Hello? <gasps> He's coming! He's not gonna see me, right? Bro... What the... 
There's someone there. Someone's in the... Someone's in the house. Should I wait for him to, to actually find me or tell him that I saw something? I'm not sure if I should keep... I feel like Mike is a creep. At the same time... Haha, uh -huh, there you are. Uh, damn Harp, it took me a while to figure out you left the house. Anything worth doing is worth doing well. My turn, close the eyes, pretty eyes now. Uh, yeah, I'm getting tired, bro. Look, I'll hide in the house. We're headed back in a, any way. You find me and we'll go to bed. No, bro, there's someone in the house. Dude, don't do this. Ah. Okay, I guess I'll be closing my eyes now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, ready or not. Here I come. I have a feeling it's that guy. It's the owner, right? It has to be. I checked the closet already before, so... Is there a closet anywhere else? What? What the fuck? What's going on? What happened? Hey there! Why the hell are you in here again, Rick? Why are you back? What are you doing with that hammer? I'm fixing the faucet. You got a problem with that? You should have told us. This is my house, I don't need to check in with you every time I fix something. Bro, it's the middle of the night, what the fuck? I've never seen anyone fix a faucet with a hammer before, exactly, bro. I you ever fixed many faucets yourself, young, young man? Didn't think so, so I'd imagine you don't know what tools you'd need. How long have you been here? Isn't it late for you? No trouble for me at all, miss. I'm right around the block. Uh, I told you. I'll get this fi- th Ugh, can't breathe. Uh, I I'll get this sink fixed for you in no time. Look, we need to go to bed now. Do you think maybe you could fix it tomorrow? You're asking me to leave, miss. No, Rick, she's being polite. We rented this house and would like to have it to ourselves. I we don't need we, we don't really want to have to call law enforcement. Ooh. Okay. Um Mike, please let me handle this. Ain't no comps in Woodbury, son. Uh oh. You think they're going to arrest me, uh the homeowner, for fixing a faucet? I was just doing some work. If you can't handle that, it's your own problem, not mine. You know what? If you folks don't like me fixing the faucet, I'll leave you to it. Bro, what the fuck? Yeah, this time we need to watch him leave actually. Okay. Definitely not creepy, but okay. Uh huh. Please don't die in me, game. After locking the door, we, de we debated what to do. We agreed that there was something off about Rick from the start. It seemed like he enjoyed making excuses to come over unannounced. In the end, we decided Rick was weird, but probably harmless. Bro, he was there with a the fucking hammer. We attributed his behavior to an extreme lack of social awareness. Bro, I, I, I don't I don't know what it is with like with these kind of people. I keep reading these like uh, true crime stories, you know, about what's going on in America and in the West in in general, and it's just like people are too trusting or too stupid. Like it's not lack of social awareness. The guy is. Uh, He's a freaking creep and he's like he was hiding in the bathroom with a, with a hammer. Come on. 
Look, we already drove all this way out there, so uh, let's just enjoy ourselves, Mike said. <laughs> but by this time I was feeling really tired, I decided to get some rest. Uh-oh. I hope Mike is not gonna try anything. Ooh. To get up. What do you want? Wait. Hop, are you still awake? Hard to sleep when someone's knocking on the door. Do you mind if I come in? I'd like to talk about something. You don't have to come in. You can just say whatever it is you want to say. Bro, chill. Bro, chill. The storm is starting to get really bad. I can hardly see the truck in the driveway. I hope Nora is okay. Yeah, that's really gotten pretty bad. I hate that Nora is out there all alone. Um, she'll be just fine, Sydney. Don't worry, I'm here to keep you safe. It's nice of you. Okay, what? Um... Oh man, really have to make that choice. That's nice of you. Hey, it's no problem at all. Guys are supposed to watch over people they care about, right? What are you talking about? What are they, huh? This wasn't exactly how I thought our getaway was going to go, Sydney. It's been a strange day. Can you believe that... Uh, can you believe that guy? He just keeps wandering around the house like he owns the place. He does own the place, though. I agree. Yeah, I wish he just cut it out. You know exactly what I mean, Sydney. He shouldn't just barge in when in the place whenever he wants. He ran in the damn house. I mean, the guy is probably harmless, but I'm frustrated. I'm, I'm frustrated as well. I really need to sleep now, Mike. It'll help if we both get some sleep. Why don't you come sit by me, Sydney? See ya! Leaving me already! <laughs> Jesus Christ. No, bro. Hop, you know? I've missed this. I was just talking. It's been too long. Okay. You know? You don't have to sleep alone tonight if you don't want to. <sighs> really, bro? You couldn't come up with anything else? Uh, Mike, where is this coming from? Would you be doing this if Nora was here? That's a good point. What? You act like you don't remember our trip to Oregon. Uh, I do remember it really well. I remember it being pretty awkward. Uh, okay. Oh yeah. Do you tell? I remember it being pretty awkward. Oh, still, so it's the same conversation either way. Uh, it didn't start out awkward, though. Mike, we had a lot to drink. Things happened. Oh. They sure did. I'm hoping maybe they can happen again. Uh-oh. So you guys slept together. Uh, oh, Mike, I don't know what to say. I guess I've been meaning to talk to you about that. Uh, you just let me worry about the details, Sydney. Mike, I don't think this is a good time. Guys, I think I'm about 70 miles away from Woodbury and my stinking tire just blew out. It's snowing and I'm on the side of the road. On Bro, you're such a useless friend. Killington. There's a <laughs> sign by the side of the I'll road. I'll be honest. It's hard to see. I, I think it says Kent Pond. The snow is like half of a deep and I can't get the lug nuts off the tire. <laughs> I hate to ask, but can you two come get me? Yes, please, bro. I take it back. You're the best friend. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Yes. Yes, bro. What a time, huh? But I guess we can't leave Nora stranded. 
Let me get dressed and I'll meet you downstairs. No, we can't. We better get ready. Okay. Uh huh. No, Sydney, you stay here and get some sleep. There's no sense in both of us freezing our asses off. You sure? Yeah, I'm sure. You're in pajamas and I'm still dressed. You just settle in and I'll go help Nora. It's really nice, Mike. I just like doing nice things for you, Sydney. Um, please be careful. We'll finish talking about this later, okay? Get some rest and stay warm. If you really feel like we have to. Um, okay, so I, it's still... No matter what you pick, it's still the same conclusion. Is he really gonna leave? Okay. Hey, why don't you get some rest while I'm alone? Are you sure it's safe to drive in this weather? Yeah, I think I'll crash for a bit. Don't worry, I've driven in worse. Besides, Nora's probably freaking out more than you right now. You're probably right. Uh, look, make sure you take care of yourself, alright? Lock all the doors. You sound like my dad. Can you blame me? Before I go, how about the hug? I mean, just in case you're asleep when I get back. I kinda need one right now. Not now? Okay, just hug him, bro, so that he can leave leave you alone. Sweet dreams, get some sleep, Sydney. Drive safe. Oh, it's freezing cold outside. Is this the end? Okay, yeah, yeah, I get it. Yeah, bro, I just want to make sure he's gonna leave. I was keen on... what? Fine. Hey. Why is the porch light on? Huh. Wait. Did I hear something? Hello? Oh yeah, I need to lock all of the doors, bro. How do I lock it? Oh, or just lock it. Just close them, right? Yeah. Anyway, that should do it, right? Gonna get back to bed? Okay. I told myself things would get better if I just got some rest. Nora always knew how to cheer me up and needed it more than by the minute. Uh, with her arriving soon, I decided to rest in the meantime. In reality, Mike just drove off to get some things to get things going <laughs> I don't think he actually drove to get her sounds to be sounds like it's too good to be true huh I don't think that's Mike I think it's the guy oh could it be someone was at the front door could it be that guy who ref who wanted to get a ride or something yeah, yeah, I'm coming. Hold your horses. Bro, I knew it! The realization that someone was outside this late at night was horrific. Bro, I knew it! It's that fucking guy! I just guessed it randomly! There's no way I'm opening that door. There's just no way. I'm going back to bed, bro. That is so fucking creepy. He literally... Someone was at the front door. I'm not opening the door. Why are you forcing me? No. And oh. Hello? Do you have any idea what time it is? Uh. Hello? 
Look, friend, I know it ain't ideal banging on your door in the middle of the night, but I'm in a bad spot here, what the fuck? I was counting on a ride from some friends, but they are running behind and won't be here for about two more hours. You can sit on the porch while they wait. You're not coming in on end of story. Uh, thanks, but I was hoping you'd let me... You let me wait inside until my friends get here. To get me? What the fuck? You're not coming in. Are you fucking kidding me? You're gonna let me freeze to death out here? I didn't make you go hiking in a snowstorm. I should have known you'd be a, a, as a big of a bitch here as you were back in the pizza place. You think I didn't see you and your little boyfriend fishing in the creek earlier? I figured maybe you'd give me a chance this time, but looks like you're still... What the fuck, bro? Unkind. <laughs> Get out or I'll call the cops. Please just leave or I'll call the cops. Ain't no cops around here. Speaking of which, I don't see your fella's truck out here either. I'm dialing 911 now. Fine. See yourself. Okay, there was a... There was a phone, right? How do I dial? But let me tell you something. You'll get what's coming to you for leaving me out of here. Karma's a bitch, my friend. What the fuck? The man at the door seemed irrelevant compared to how tired I was. Are you sure about that? Bro, he followed you all the way from the pizza place and was stalking you all this time. Oh boy, okay. Yeah, sure. Whatever. Get some rest. Okay. What the? Bruh. Someone threw something at the window. At this point I had no choice but to what? Oh god damn it, I was like too preoccupied with the text. Asking this guy to come over now. Jesus. What did she say? At this point I need to hide her or something. I really didn't see that. Didn't see that message. I guess I need to investigate, right? I thought someone already broke into the house. Open the door, miss. It's me. Don't tell me these guys are in the in cahoots. What the hell's going on here? Oh, thank God you're here, Rick. I'm so glad you came. Did you see anyone outside? I might have seen something. Could have been anyone or no one at all. Explain the situation. Yeah, I came as quickly as I could. I wouldn't worry about him anymore. What? What do you mean? Still didn't feel safe open- By the way, where's your friend? The guy who was with you earlier, Mike? You went to pick up our friend. He should be back soon. Hmm. So you're all alone here, right? 
Yeah, but my friends will be back soon. What the fuck? Okay. Storms like this bring out all kinds of folks. Not all of them know when to stay away. Uh huh. Come back over? What do you mean? I live in Burlington. I haven't been to the rental in weeks. Bruh! Come at me, bro. Come at me, bro. See ya. See ya, bro. See ya. Didn't feel safe opening the door, huh? What? You're telling me I can't escape? Bro. No way. What if he catches me? Okay. Um, do you have any... Any weapons? <laughs> Just the games. Messages. Mike. Where are you, Mike? Where's the Mike when you need him? No. Yeah, yeah, sure, come here. No. No. Oh, crap, I can't... Can I go... I can't. Can I go down the to the basement? Oh, I can. Need to hide, need to hide, bro. Do I, do I actually need to talk to him? Everything's okay, miss? Yeah. Awful late for texting, isn't it? Who are you talking to? It's my friends, they're almost here. You are not Rick, are you? Who are you? Is that so? Yeah, thanks for coming by, though. You can head back if you want. I'll be fine now, you can head back if you want. You sure about that? Yeah, I just overreacted. Maybe I should stick around, make sure everything is really okay. You need to leave right now. What did you just say? This is my fucking house. I will leave when I want. You need to leave right now. Get out of here before I call the cops. Um. I mean... It's pretty obvious what he wants, right? So, he did say there is no cops and I don't think so. If anyone is leaving this house, it will be one of us. What the fuck? Oh bro, what the fuck? Okay, I guess I need to... Do I hide or just do I, do I run away? There's nowhere I can run to, right? Should have used this sign while he was breaking the door. I was just curious to see what was going on. Okay, yeah, didn't see anyone outside, explain the situation, blah blah blah, yeah, I came here as fast as I could. 
Wouldn't worry about him anymore. The fuck? By the way, where's your friend? Mike, you went upside to pick our friend. Should be back soon. My friends will be back soon. <sighs> Dude. Okay. What do you mean? I live in Burlington. I have been in Trenwell for weeks. Yeah. It's my friends. They're almost here. I'll be fine now. Yeah. What did you just say? <laughs> it's the same thing. Get out of here before I call the cops. Okay, bro. I'm leaving as well. Hey, 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 come on. Run. Run, bro. Hey. Where'd you run? He broke the door. I could technically run out of the other door. And, uh... And run around the house. Hiding in the basement. Yes, bro, thank you. I love the creator for making this chapter. Okay. I don't have to redo the entire thing. Which is good. Okay, dog. Go, 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 go. Hey. Le, 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 le. Close the door. Uh. Oh, oh, oh! He barricaded everything. Motherfucker, he's still here. You 
motherfucker. Did you just trip? Okay, so the doors are still blocked. I need to um, text back, I guess. Oh, hiding in the basement again. Oh, okay, hiding in the basement. Hiding in the basement. How am I supposed to get past the guy then? Right, he listened to my mic. Can just open and close the door at the same time while being dead. Okay, nice. Okay, here it goes. Crap. Okay. Running upstairs. Gonna hide in the bedroom. Close the door. Hide here. to do. Bruh. Okay, I guess I need to try and hide it. to hide in the attic. He couldn't find me, right? Can't find me in the attic. Or can he? Bruh. Just got done talking to the other guests on the phone. I've called 911. Thank you, bro. Kitty. You're a good kitty. I can't go downstairs just yet, right? Since they did call 911, so I assume it's safe to go outside. Oh god. YOLO Oh, it's a uh, pretty chill music now Yay! Did we, did we win? Bruh No way That dude left the house Oh Hi Mike, my hero Bro I'm not gonna lie <laughs> I told them everything that happened after Mike left. Rick had called the cops. The storm had quieted down by the time they arrived. And of course the man was nowhere to be seen. 
on our drive back the whole night played over and over in my head. We think that the man was... Uh, he secretly lived in the cabin when it wasn't being used and planned on robbing us during our stay. But cops seemed to think that uh, he was... had... There was uh, more intent behind this man's actions from just robbing us, you don't say. Uh, Rick asked me what the man looked like and after he... Um, and after that he didn't ask any more questions. Uh, but in the end he gave us a full refund. Oh, that's nice of him. Didn't really have a choice, right? And that's it, right? It's a happy ending. Even though the story was pretty messed up. Yeah. Fairs to fathom, dude. It's a... Uh, it's a really good game. Uh, I like the jump scares. The story was nice and it's actually cool that it's kind of based on true story. Uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to playing through other parts of it as well. Uh, but yeah, if you like what you've seen, thumbs up and I'll see you later.